my name is Tony Lee. I work for the New York Times on the delivery engineering team. Um, I'm a site reliability engineer and um, I work on our continuous delivery platform, um, our Kubernetes, strat Kubernetes strategy, as well as exploring other tools. Most of our CNCF technologies that we use at the New York Times are Kubernetes, FluentD, and gRPC. We're also actively exploring uh, other technologies such as Envoy and Prometheus. Um, our biggest use case is Kubernetes, where it's helped us package a lot of our applications and um, enable them to be migrated from uh, our data center into the cloud pretty quickly. It took a bit of changing in the application and development and culture to get there, but in the process of doing so, uh, we've been able to revisit architectures, improve the monitoring visibility into those applications, and um, kind of modernize the way that the New York Times runs its technology. The most exciting part about the CNCF, I think, is that it's kind of like a guiding force behind uh, a lot of these open source projects. The ones under the foundation receive a lot of guidance and support and um, assurance for companies who are using them that they might not typically get with other open source projects. The, the reason why we think the CNCF is a good foundation and why we participate in the CNCF is that we're investing in our own future in a sense. Uh, the CNCF is able to kind of rally a community around these projects, provide the support that they need, and we see that as um, planting a seed for the future in uh, a world where we're using the CNCF's technologies and benefiting from the training and the certification and the conformance that it brings to these technologies in the industry as a whole. The biggest reason why I like going to KubeCon is not just for the toss, but the ability to meet with a lot of different people and companies and speak on our experiences with all these different technologies. Since they're so new, uh, being able to exchange these kind of battle stories or um, use cases or case studies uh, is one of the, I think, best ways to learn from each other and from the community.